we have a draft. We do indeed. Right. There it is. Can oh, TNC bounce man. back? I think they can. I, I think TNC, even with that loss, I think it was a slightly draft related thing with not having answers to Tinker. To me, they're still like the favorite team. Maybe not down 1 0, less, like, probably not favorite because they've got to win two games in a row. But I would say like they're still like 60 40 favorites to win game two. Yeah. I, I think so too. Am I still my laptop now? Oh, I'm so sorry. You're not well, you just want my phone. I do. Those pictures that. aren't for you. Give me that. <laughs> but you sent them to me. <laughs> That's weird. Ten Let's seconds see. remaining. Oh, wow. There's our heroes. Back. Yeah, those are the overpowered ones, indeed. Mm. Oh, you're looking at the pubs again? I love this site, actually. It's a, it's, it's really good. So, I Enigma I feel like first. I, I, I always forget to use it, and then every like, few months I'll be like, wait, I need to use this before... If I'm going to talk about pub win rates, I, I'm better off using the, the pub pro games rather yeah. than... I the, just saw on my Twitter Twitter that uh, you and a bunch of other people Ten followed them on uh, on Twitter as ah, well. Ah, there you go. Yeah, yeah. They they tweeted for like the first time in like a year, and I, I saw it popped up on my feed because of um, D2 Bowie. D2 Bowie. Oh yeah. He fo he followed or retweeted them, and I was like, holy shit, these guys have a Twitter, because they added like um, some new pro players who they weren't tracking. Yeah, um, cool. He put out another thing. I wanted. To, I'm going to check out what it was because there was something that he put out yesterday about the patch yeah. that was like okay. a weird bug. Who Bowie? Yeah. Oh boy. Okay. He makes good videos. Yeah. He does. He's, he's competing with my videos though. So. Mm. Let's talk about. <laughs> let's not talk about them. Well, he just he has apparently better. <laughs> you guys out there, you. you don't like Jenkins? Check out D2 Bowie. <laughs> <laughs> he just. Uh, he yeah, so check out D2 Bowie. <laughs> he has a new Twitter name. It's Good Juju. Hmm. That's pretty good. I like that. Okay. He, uh, he's, I, I don't know, he, he changes his Twitter names too too often. <laughs> I'll see a tweet pop up, I'm like, who the hell is this? I don't follow this person. I'm like, oh, it's Bo. <laughs> what is with people changing their like on online names like often and pictures yeah, yeah. and stuff like that? So. The one I, that yeah. a lot of people do that I, I annoys me for no reason whatsoever is when they, it's the at this event, when they change oh, their Twitter name yeah. to let everyone know they're at an event. I'm just oh, like, no. Oh, okay, we're going to get three. They what have Doom. you done? <laughs> it's, I don't know, Doom's... So uh, congratulations to TNC Predator <laughs> for making the. That's it's not game three though. No. I mean, no, it's we, very we demoralizing to lose with the Doom. Ah, this is what it was. It's that Thompson apparently has started playing Rubik mid, and Ten with your arcane two. supremacy, you can go meteor hammer, and it's a perfect combination. And then with your level 25 mm. talent, it's 9.5 seconds of disable. Jesus Christ. Topson Top getting Meteor Hammer. Topson is obsessed <laughs> with that item. <laughs> Courtesy of each boy. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty cool stuff there. Uh, but Grimstroke, Doom, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, we're, we're kind of haters on the Doom. Obviously, we know less than these teams do. We've just seen Dota. Don't they just seen Dota. glitch right now? Isn't this just lich? I, I mean, I like the adjustment that they... Prioritize brew over lich because the afraid? brew the brew is way more important to me. Wow, I think they're just sick of losing with lich because they've lost yeah. three games today with it. They've yeah. won one and lost three today. Maybe they're realizing that they just overvalue it. Yeah, I want to see what hey, the uh, win rate. Your on. analysis, Jenkins, here yeah. before getting into game two about the lich. There you go. So I was trying to fill because they were waiting in the lobby for so long or anything <laughs> yeah. like that. Yeah, that you didn't actually nice. believe your analysis. You're just <laughs> talking about bullshit, but yeah, yeah. Yeah. it works sometimes. <laughs> sometimes it does. I want to see what the win rate is on these freaking Doom, because I swear it's got to be god-awful. Uh, it's actually not on most successful heroes. Uh, is it on most pick? Because it'll have a win rate then. No. No. Can you search, search, search Doom? You can just search the hero. 47. That's on Dota Buff? Yeah. yeah. That's We're going to check the, the pro games, too. Okay. Or the pro pub games. It's not Doombringer. It's just Doom. What, what, what's going on? Got to click. Click the search bar. I did. You typed oh in ice, ice, ice. That's no. That's not I what you're... <laughs> I didn't accidentally <laughs> type in an entire, like, ice three times in a row. I didn't accidentally do that. And then you click where it says the word doom. That's what I did. It's loading. Look. Turn to okay. <laughs> yeah, we got to get some better internet here. What's going on? Come Look, on. It's the website. I need some better hosting. So he's got a win rate of... 50%. Exactly 50%? Oh. I mean, I, I mean, it would round. Uh, it's it's mostly played by Bulba. <laughs> 11. <laughs> Tim's played it three times. Blizzy played it three and Papita at two oh, in the Tim's last played week. It. Okay. Probably trying lost, to four lost, 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 lost. I would be way more down for a position four Doom here. It feels like a Febby hero, too. Yeah, that could, that could work. He could do but the old China do? Febby, Febby plays the Grimstroke, though. I don't, I don't okay. think that's... I think this team, Mineski, has always done four-position Grim, and then they pick a um, Pilot Eye Hero, like a Bane or something. Against Phoenix, maybe they consider... Phoenix, you could bring back the Silencer. I, I wouldn't mind that too much. 
I feel like Skyrath Mage is just a better option against the Phoenix. It's actually a good hero. But as a as a five? Silencer is also really five. good against Brew. So is Skyrath Mage. <laughs> I mean, but you don't have, like, the global save, right? Oh, who cares? Yeah. Uh, heroes, that hero is everywhere. It does feel nice to just null tally people. It, it's pretty It's pretty nice. Grim 5, too. Faceless Void Ban. Void. Void's really uh, Phoenix. being featured heavily in this SEA qualifiers. Here, Fnatic as well. We're play picking and played a lot some of the other SEA teams. So many good synergies with other top meta picks. Yep. Carries. What's left for carries with the Phantom Assassin? Pretty pretty solid hero. Teams need to make sure they do not forget about the Timbersaw as well. Oh, God. The fourth pick Timbersaws. We haven't been seeing a lot of Monkey King today. I've seen a few bands, like late in the draft, yeah. like fourth or even like, a I think I've seen some last band Monkey Kings. I think both of these teams have kind of okay answers for Timbersaw. Um, maybe less so the Brew, um, but like Brimstroke Doom seems like it's okay. We can throw the Timber up with the with the Brew. It's yeah, it's pretty good. Turn to pick. Oh, and then this Night Stalker band coming out again. I mean, even still, it feels like you need so much to deal with that hero with the new armor. So tanky. Yeah, that's why I like the, the the lift up does sound good though. Yeah, that definitely sounds legit. And the Phantom Embrace is kind of annoying for him to deal with too. Yeah, he just doesn't want to right click it. I mean, he literally can't with Chakra Mount. So if you Phantom if you Phantom Embrace him with the Chakra Mount, yeah, he's then he's, he's just he's just bone. chilling. He's just permanently he's just <laughs> like, what am I gonna do? <laughs> so probably gonna pick their. Hero five roll now, five yeah. Roll. If yeah. they, unless they're planning on a Doom Four and Grim, I, I, I think Mineski I mean, only, Efebi is the only one who plays Grim for them. Lich, Lich is still available. They could still do a, do a Doom yeah. Lich lane and throw the. They seem to prefer like the disable sometimes. No. Oh, they want to get the. And yeah, Naga gets Kay. through. Okay. It's pretty good against the Phoenix because you throw the Fire Spirits and Naga just purges it instantly, so you can kill the egg, song and kill the egg. It's too, still possible. Like you've got a. Cast it in during the cast time and then gap close the egg as well, like as a melee hero. Like yeah. I don't feel like it's an actual like true egg killer, yeah. not like a Lena Morana type hero. Yeah, you can still like set up for your team to do it though with the with the song. Yeah. Same thing with the like serpent wards song, ser kill serpent wards. Yep. They definitely need an egg hitter though, otherwise they're gonna bring the pain. They're still a lich, man. Lion. Ooh. Huh. Illusion clear with the mana drain. That's always yeah. been a w popular support answer to Naga and. Good burst damage. Does the multi drain do it? I, f I, I, yeah. I remember oh it yeah. Yeah. for a while. I like heroes like Lion always. These burst damage heroes against Doom, because these Dooms, with the way they're building, they want to walk in, use their Doom. They get these tanky items, but like Lion Phoenix, there is crazy magic damage. If he walks yeah, in, gets impaled, really fingered, Sunray, etc., he's going to die. Instant hex, too, so Doom can't just Five get the Doom. Yes. It's, such, it's so telegraphed. It's so ridiculously telegraphed. Lion can so easily just stop his initiation. Yeah, it's it's a hard doom game against the lion. Yeah. Bane, that's Bane. that's the hero I thought they'd third pick, but they wanted to. I think prioritize Naga as a block pick as well. Oh it's no! TB. I mean, I, I think this is a better TB game. This is not like the Messi were like first two in TB. You don't like TB against these heroes? It's good against Naga. You um, got a ban Tinker. It, the lane could be rough. The Doom Grimstrick lane. And the, you it's, know, a, it's a hard lane. That's a very yeah. hard lane to deal with. I mean, if you're Tim TB, you fall back in jungle. I don't know if that's <sighs> changed too much. I feel like last patch was just, yeah, it doesn't matter if the lane's hard. You've got the jungle to fall back on. You can always get something somewhere. I don't know. I just think that this hero has run into so many different issues um, and has proven to be not the same force that he was previously. There's still a Morphling in the pool if they wanted to run that mid, but for Maneski, although there's against Lion, that's less there's palatable. There's Zeus. There's Tinker. There's a lot of answers to the to the TB, but I honestly feel like one of the biggest answers to the TB is just the fact that everybody is rushing bracers, wraith bands, and fighting and securing early towers. So yes, you can always go back to the jungle, but if your entire jungle is controlled by the enemy team because you've lost the two surrounding tier ones, then who cares? You have one jungle to farm. Where's the rest of your team going to go? The thing I like about this, though, is that they have three heroes that can move around the map and get stuff done with Terrorblade. So I do like it better as a Terrorblade game than the previous ones because he doesn't need to do stuff like the rest of his team can do it 
Yeah, um, that's the fair. The other problem that you're going to run into with TB, though, is the mana cost and Naga Siren gain Diffusal Blade. So that's going to be a little bit tough that you won't be able to Sunder, most likely. Yeah. Ten seconds remaining. I can't help but feel that Naga Siren is just the better better version of this Terra Blade hero right now. Just t song out Predator if things go kind of tinker. That makes total sense, particularly after last game. Force him into like a Zeus type hero that you can actually respond to and counter and get a mid lane. It's on oh, your TNC you don't have last pick. It's they they, yeah. they have to p they have to pick something that deals with these with these illusions. There's n there's nothing that they have that, that why it does really deal no the terribly oh yeah. got it, got it, got it. I mean Grimstrick has the nuke but that does not sound monkey. like enough and here's the monkey we haven't seen enough of this feels like this hero doesn't have that many terrible mid matchups although Husker yeah. might be one of them let's see the Husker I think monkey I think monkey does okay against Husker I maybe mean, not the new Husker, Husker doesn't though. have the attack range to stay away from monkey maybe I think so yeah and especially in the mid lane so high magic damage. Zeus is a clear pick. Yeah, yeah they could just could just Zeus. What else they need? They don't really have a good team fight starter initiator as puck. well. Puck might be yeah, a thing. Puck, puck kind of fills that gap. Um, I Zeus. Don't so. Zeus. Okay. It's really good against Monkey too. You can scout him like as he's trying to jump around in the trees. Oh. The you can scout him, but you can't normally. You can't break bring it. him off yeah, the yeah. tree. Yeah, but but even still, it's like Monkey. Monkey just isn't as yep. hard to catch with the Zeus on your team. One of the biggest things about Monkey is the fact that he's inv like you can't see him when he's jumping around the trees. Guys, I don't know what to do. I hate Doom and I hate Terrorblade, so I don't know where I stand. <laughs> uh, TNC got this, I think. You think so? I, I, I don't. I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> I'm probably wishful thinking, you know, hoping for a game three, which yeah, is you know it's six true. in the morning. We, the Coster thing to do would be hoping for two right now. We we I want to see more. We we saw KP playing the the Doom earlier, and he went for the kind of mobility build, which I liked. The Shadow Blade, yeah. But they had a Morphling that wasn't getting any space whatsoever, and he was kind of taking it as well. But I think with the Zeus Naga, these heroes can fight early enough that they can just run at them. I think I think it's fine to go for that sort of build on, on Doom. Although I hope that he didn't go that build earlier, and he's like, oh, I get why people are doing this Crimson Guard. I'm gonna give it a try. <laughs> I hope he doesn't do that. He's turned off because he lost with the Shadow. Yeah, because I I, re I really think that if they if they run at TNC Predator in the early game with these heroes, uh, they're going to they're gonna have a, a pretty great time as long as he goes for that build where he can actually get on top of a hero. I mean, he needs to because they don't have that you know blink stun initiator type hero. Yeah, it kind of needs to be him maybe. Yeah, Naga can kind of. Be that tanky guy running in, maybe not. I don't know. I, 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 think, that they I think the problem is there's a lion. So if someone's running in, they're they're here that's getting burst and blowing right. up. Right, and I feel like this is like sort of a both four protect one e type of draft where you're just gonna have these other heroes pushing out side lanes and the other four are gonna be running at each other and trying to find that carry. So I don't know. It's sort of a also a battle of who is it that's gonna have the better vision. Um, Zeus. That's what Zeus gives Zeus's you. Zeus's team. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Monkey gets some, you know, dance around some trees. Yeah, not as good though. <laughs> that's not. Nowhere near. It's not really scouting our vision, anyways, except for that very small area. If Maybe he'll get the uh, the vision talent. Like for the vision talent, yeah. I saw someone do it uh, recently. Offlane monkeys yeah, do that. Exactly. A it, was lot of it was an offlane monkey, yeah. I'm pretty sure. Um, but should be should be a good game. I'm looking forward to seeing the the monkey king come back as well. That's always a fun here to watch. Yeah. I don't know if I want to see the doom do well. I've, I've played it a lot in this patch. It's really boring. It's a really boring. Just sitting there being tanky with your regen. So. Exactly. It's not. It's not the most I fun. Thing. I didn't like. The, uh, I mean, I didn't dislike the change. There was some really good quality of life changes um, with the devour, like how you can keep your old spell and stuff. Um, but I feel like this year's biggest problem that I wish was changed back that got mega nerfed is just the doom cast time. Yeah. It used to be so much better. The fact it has this huge wind up. I don't even think it's like that, like OP, amazing of a spell because of often the hero that gets doomed will just get out anyways. Yeah, that's why I like the Shadow Blade though, because the wind up, like you're winding up while invisible. Yeah, I mean there are so, sort of a couple other things to watch Centuries, also. Though. Is that oftentimes like VP back in the day would pick the Doom as the answer to the Terror Blade, um, and it worked out for them fairly well. Granted, this is not VP. Uh, but still, something to keep your eyes on. And then the other one is going to be how this sort of r reflection works with the Naga Siren Illusions. Um, Get that Riptide Steel. Yeah. They should uh, proc Riptide. Yeah. It's not like a crazy amount of damage because you just got, like, the... what? I guess you're, what, getting on the Illusions as well, so maybe yeah. it will be a crazy amount of damage. That's what I'm wondering. If you can get those Reflection Illusions attacking. Maybe this is something that one of these players has played in a pub, and it's like, oh my god, the Terra Blade against Naga is so cancer, you know? 
I think they're just like kind of you mentioned they're similar heroes. You think the Naga is a better TB, but the fact you have a hero that can match Naga's split push and use the illusions to push out waves, creep cut, yeah, and do it safely. Like you keep your your heroes in a safe position while your illusions move on out. Looks like JT is swapping. Yeah, they're swapping the lanes. They want Doom against the Brew. Okay. He can survive the pressure that's going to come their way. Yeah. Yeah. Bottom lane is Terrorblade going to be able to deal with this pressure, at least at the get go. Oh, and they're going to hide Febby over here to the side and see if they can get a first blood. Starting as a tri lane, this is something very common in South American Dota right now. And we're seeing it spill over to the Southeast Asian region. If I can't have you, no one will. Nightmare into Inkswell? I don't know. Uh, he's got so enough, uh, yeah, that level one nightmare is going to be the way to go. Maybe yeah. they're trying to, they're waiting for him to use the meta, so when he uses it, they kill him and then. Oh, look at Gabby. Nice. He's, he's, going, he's, going, he's going to get a quelling. Blade. Blade. And now they got the Inkswell on him. Trying to get the stun. They still managed to find the Inkswell stun, but that does give the game away. Yeah, they hadn't seen him too, so he may have even been considering scouting while doing that as well. KP ate the wrong tree. See, so here's he the issue with not with. He's got the mango. But he, the quelling, look, he's got the quelling in his quick buy, but he can't get it. He can't get over there. Yeah. So he's getting denied. Oh, I gotta bring Ninja Phoenix. Boogie over. He's Phoenix level two, I imagine. Is that he waited level one? Oh, it's level one. Okay. He wanted to bring the salve over for Ninja Boogie. It looks like too. And Febby, all of a sudden in no man's land. Oh, he is so dead. That metamorphosis is gonna get a stun. Is he gonna juke? They oh my can't. god! No, oh, he used the salve. Yeah. Yeah. They got the kill on Gabby too. That's really nice. That was that was very close to being sick, but he he used the the salve with the with the Phoenix Spirit still on him. I think I think he actually could have just kept running and used the salve a little bit later because they didn't have vision of him and they walked up to the north. And he went down south. That's a monkey securing those range creeps and off to a, a slight advantage here in the first few waves. Although Zeus has a wave coming to his tower, I'm trying That's to use that mischief to dodge arc damage. Oh man, I want to see him use Mischief to dodge Thunder God's Wrath. That would be insane. It's like he knows that Zeus is going to try and kill Steel him or that something. That would be. Use that audio cue and just. And just <laughs> or like a buyback or something. Buyback Thunder Gods, he mischiefs. Ooh. See, this double wave, it's all. Uh, you always see this. Not in the bot lane, though. They're controlling it. This is such a massive wave. You're so happy for KP up here. Cuckoo's about to get a lot of farm and CS coming his way. Yeah, I guess it's a one v one, so they're uh, both they're both pretty happy. Yeah, that's it. Cuckoo's got his quelling blade, so he'll get most of that farm out of the tower. Mm -hmm. And TB has not been truly pressured, but the first blood, he's actually got some good farm going his way. Ninja boogie. Well, they get the stun on the walk away, and now the slow, double slow, have themselves the hex and the split earth, or splitter rather, and Febby just in some trouble, gonna die. Three man reflection, some value harassed from Gabby, and helping set things up for the trialing to get a kill. Good stuff for TNC down here, at least. This was. Terrible is that actually not a bad hero to, to trialing just because of that reflection. This hero was did pretty well in the tri lane v tri lane meta. God, Doom just does not care. Brew does not care about Doom. <laughs> it's definitely one of those lanes that could have gone strongly either way. Like if he used that meta on the first wave and tried to start lasting and harassing and dies, like yeah, that, yeah. that gank from from the trees, it would have been an absolutely awful lane. I think that's what they were waiting for, but right. they didn't they didn't quite no. get it. Instead if it goes the other way and TB gets first blood, suddenly it's an incredibly one lane for the radiant side, which is what we're looking at so far. And they're actually wrapping around up here. I wonder if KP's going to end up going for the uh, Arcane Boots since he has that Shockwave. It's kind of a cool build that sometimes people do. Yeah, with the buffs, it's uh, definitely a lot more viable. I feel and like later on, you can get the Greaves. I like the Phase Boots just make way too much sense on Doom, though, with, with how he wants to play. Like, you, you want to run people down and keep using the Infernal Blade on them. If you can get that second Infernal Blade off, you're going to get kills that you otherwise shouldn't. Yeah. It just keeps you right on top of people and gives you r extra armor to work with. Well, right now, Doom is having himself a nice old time here. I love this part. Looks like the bottle region going to come in. He'll back up Cuckoo, and then he can come back to lane. But it's sort of a dual lane, oh, and KP is going to rotate. That's a nice bottle pickup because bounty runes are coming up, so he, re he wants to refill it with the 
these bounty runes. Although Bane is up there at top trying to contest. Did, uh, did he get it? Nice. Yeah, Cuckoo so got the bounty rune. That's big, and he may get a kill off of this. Oh, trading over the aggro. Okay. Paladai gets out. Yeah. Bounty rune for Paladai. Gru did get the first one, at least. So he gets the bottle refill, so his lane will look a whole lot better. Sending Doom down here at level... F oh, he's actually going for the Max Infernal Blade build. So he's trying to potentially kill this Terra Blade right now. Oh, thanks well. They have the reflection already, taking a lot of damage here, and with that, it's well. he just stays on top of him with the. Uh, oh, he's got the face really close. They got him. Yeah. Well played. I like this. I like this build. I like this build a lot more than like the max Q. Uh, mm -hmm. and they end up killing the lion also, moving into position. Pilot die trying to find this counter armor. Oh. He misses and needs to keep a little bit away. He didn't want to get too close, seeing how low he was. Yeah, it looked. You know, one thing that I'm seeing with these mid monkey kings is a lot of roaming and early points into the uh, the the tree jump, just so you can push out the creep wave, and then you roam to the side lane, push out the creep wave, roam to the side lane, and you just don't get punished at all for doing that because you can push the wave out with the primal spring, and you can gank with it as well. That was something that mid one on Seeker was doing all the time at the the major because yeah. they it, they were trying to enable Nisha to carry the game on like some morphling TB whatever, and having this Monkey King making moves just helped do that so much. I think it's also just great because if you're pushing out the lane, like as you can see, he's, going he's got two points in it now. Uh, if you push out the lane first, like you're not putting yourself in a position where you can just sit in the mid lane and farm and get ganked. It's just, uh, it's much better just to pr like for defensive purposes. Like you're being aggressive to also be defensive. Yeah. And also it gives him double the farm because he can just push out the lane and then go jungle, worst case scenario. Yeah. Man, look at this, Terra Blade just can't come back into this lane now. Yeah, I, I, I'm a huge fan of just maxing the Infernal Blade. Given the, how the new phase boots work, I feel like it's perfect for the max Infernal Blade build. This is a Doom build that makes, I think, a lot more sense than what we saw. Like, the, the four points in Devour that seems to just not crush these lanes. You're tanky, but you don't crush, yeah. You it's just don't do much. You don't die. That's that's the most kind of extent of it. The thing oh is, God. you don't you don't die with these items and... I think One point in, or two points in Devour anyway. Gets the right tree and... Oh, nice little juke around, but... Oh, he's no. not going to keep... He's not going to keep looking. Uh, he, oh, he do you have... Does he not have a Quelling Blade, or... He assumes he maybe TP'd out? Yeah. He just so doesn't want to waste the here. time looking for the Phoenix. That's big. Tim's is going to get the level 5 off of this, at least. If not more. Top lane. Trying Where's to find JT. <laughs> Slow down, but the song. And see you later. Gets the point at level 6, so... Keep him honest and force that long cooldown right away. 160 <laughs> seconds. KP realizes now and he's <laughs> muted. Is he going to live through so, this doom? So he oh my god, he jukes in there again. Oh, are you kidding no, he's me? He's in an unreachable place. I think. No, he doomed him. He's oh. doomed. No, he, Oh, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> he, just, he just juked in there again. <laughs> KP must just not know there's a spot there. I think that he I think he <laughs> Oh, he's throwing tango. fire spirits for the full Oh RPM. my god, KP. Oh. He must have, yeah, tangoed that earlier without the doom realizing that he tangoed through He it. did, I think, yeah. What a freaking spot. That is insane. Oh, this is That's the peak performance. So supporting. crippling for this Doom in some ways. Just wasting his time. And Phoenix is going to have an incredibly fast level 6. Having a hero that's able to stay down here, keep the tower alive in this tricky, dangerous lane that's is... the ideal scenario. Yeah. God, he's going to watch back this replay 100% and just be like, where the heck was he? Oh man! Hello, KP. Meanwhile, Thanks for watching our split. He's not listening to us. This is the Naga. That, that's <laughs> no sleep. Oh god, they got him. I and mean, this is almost come online. He knows. He just needs to roam around the map, make moves. TB is the guy that's going to win you the game. He's your win condition. Let has six now. The monkey move. Is he going to show <laughs> him where his spot do was? It again? Oh, he's juking oh, no, around. He's not. He's, not. he's going to just Debbie. egg here if he gets too low. Oh, he can't egg. He good needs silence. To good first. silence. Needs to get the egg up and never mind. Uh, I wonder if it was just planning on dying there and didn't want to waste the cooldown, or Let's if uh, he just got caught by surprise by the Thunder God's Wrath. I think KP is dead. Oh, they're bringing in the Zeus, though. Draining the mana, trying oh, to do this, skip. get to the heal. Is it enough? Yes. There's another Bolt soon. Yep. This isn't the end. That's the downside of this build, not having more points in the Jingu, but at the same time, I, I don't think there's value in Jingu this game. Phoenix comes back in. He's still on his egg. Yep, keep this tower alive. There's a lot of damage. Level three fire spirits. If they're not careful. Oh. 
big plays overall. Um, you hit the 10 minute mark right now, we can see that it's all the core is still having a pretty good time and looking relatively even. What, what do we need to watch out for over the next couple minutes from these guys? Mm. I think fighting around the Doom cooldown and the Brewer Split cooldown, uh, I think both of which are down. The Egg is pretty important too. I, I honestly think the TNC could take a smoke with the Brew cooldown. Oh yeah, you can see that they... Oh, that was actually the, the Doom's team that purchased that smoke. So is Doom up? I, I assume Doom is up. We're going to try to smoke and maybe kill the Terra Blade or something like that. He's been just chilling in the jungle. Oof. Regen. Well, they're going to go towards Tim's again. They'd Radiant love to be able to save scanning. the Doom cooldown here. He has wasted so much of Minaski's time down here on this tower. And they can't break his Tranquils either, so even through this Doom, he's going to be regening up, and, well, he's maybe not enough. <laughs> That's, like, a very okay death. Did they smoke for that? Does Grimstrok still have the smoke? I think he does, yeah. No, it's in the, yeah, it's in oh, it's in the stash. Yeah, yeah okay. So he, just, he just came Doomed from the trees there. I mean, even still, it's Doom, Doom utilized for just a Phoenix kill. This tower was like should have been dead earlier, but he's been wasting so much time down here. TNC haven't had much success pushing top though. They they lift the siege creep there. It looks like they may be able to get this counter tower, but they're being they're being juked themselves. Like we're watching this bottom lane Grimstroke meanwhile top. These is supports, man. The support created a little pathway through. Halliday is six, but they they kept the siege alive thanks to the glyph. So. Yeah, well, Pebby, maybe in some trouble. Maybe trying to bait this out with Pile of Die, or is Pebby just going to die? The Phoenix Fall. Okay. And there's going to be some bonus one step. Yeah, one step bonus damage. I don't know Gotta if that use it now. I, I guess you do. It it's a long cooldown at level one, though. All reflection and the runaway. He's fine, though. There's a TP in the game. And a regen. He's just being quietly farming. Hello, Cuckoo. He did go for the max devour after the three points. Oh, doesn't have mana for the bean script right now. Might need ulti. Doesn't need it. This big looking really solid. This it game. really is. What are, what, are the, what are they nerf about him? Scores. It's like a couple things, right? No, nothing, nothing too huge. I think they made us a cool, cooldown reduction. Doesn't uh, affect, affect the Nimbus. The affect the ulti, Nimbus right? yeah. yeah, the Nimbus. Second ulti. Really, it is. Yeah, it's a, it's a second ulti. It's better. I mean, it's way better than his ulti. So yeah, that's yeah, it's a pretty decent nerf. But it doesn't it doesn't nerf like the base the base Zeus and the base Zeus like without the the Nimbus is the reason that you pick the the, the Zeus against the Terra Blade. You want to kill the illusions with all the the magical damage mainly from the Arc Lightning and the percentage damage. I think that Arc Lightning damage that level twenty five talent got nerfed too. Yeah. Did it? Yeah, I think uh, it was like, like a patch. Not in the seven point two zero. That was before. Yeah, yeah, that was, that was before. It. Even still, it like still two hits creep waves and it still demolishes yeah. the illusions. I think it used to be plus 170, I want to say. Something like that, yeah. Now it's 155. Yeah. Still still a lot. Armel. Just chilling here. He's, he's going to clear the wave, gets in, gets out. Well, they're going to be able to deward that as well. Pile die, still hanging on to his first grip. Hasn't had to use it yet. He has 1,000 gold. Happy times. What's he going to buy? This, this is the richest that I've ever seen Pile die. He's he's had this net worth at like 50 minutes in other games. <laughs> Am I wrong about that? Like last no, game. Definitely. <laughs> I don't top disagree. Tower is under Shadow Blade is going to be the call for Mr. KP. I I greatly prefer the way KP is playing Doom. Despite all that Phoenix stuff happening. Do salt for some vision, but nothing's fishing. No one's really moving around too much, and I think after the Zeus ult is used, TNC will be inspired to perhaps go for an aggressive smoke maneuver. And they are grouping up, and yeah, they're, they're smoking. It's again a little bit of a scary thing, because like, you, you lose one game now, and you're just out of the major. But looks like they want to try and make the move into that jungle, and JT. Can they find the Naga? You kind of have to just walk into the other jungle. It's one of those things I feel like on the dire team, like you use that Zeus ult and you see them, but and then you your Zeus is probably calling their if they go they're missing, gonna, they're, they're gonna, gonna smoke. smoke. Yeah, 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 it's yeah, such yeah. a common play to smoke yeah, after yeah. a Zeus ult that you need to play more careful. And they're gonna smoke forward. You can smoke yourself. No. Fight. You're right though, they, they they know that they're in here. They know that they smoked into there. 
Oh, Phoenix is perfect here to break it. Unless you doom him, he's going to get away with these. The Shadow Blade may catch him by surprise, though. That, was a, oh, that, was a that is the most important target right there to do. And they killed off Tim's Problem also is with the Phoenix grip. they did not get a commit. There's nobody else. That is like, doom is their fight start, but he doesn't have a lockdown. Yeah. At least I got the Phoenix, but I think that happens regardless of yeah. his doom. And TB, while well, this is all going on, is farming, so I think... So is Naga. Yeah, that's true. No, no, good point. <laughs> Such a weird game. Yeah, <laughs> they're, they're, they're just matching each these other, are the, really. These are the same hero, But that's the thing. It's like what we were talking about. It's just four protect one, sort of, but it's not even like protect. It's just four avoid one. Yeah, it's <laughs> the way you play four. the four protect one is by playing away from that hero and creating space. Yeah. So Doom not available. That's why the Radiant's looking to fight. Oh, they jumps on the tree. together. Uh, they're not too long, though. Well, run away, stun oh. onto those two. Still have the hurl boulder. He's got no shadow. I mean, Doom has 10 45 regen. There's no way to kill this guy. This doesn't even kill him. I'm 100% sure of it. Oh. All right, nice. <laughs> <laughs> I was quietly waiting. Good. Because I'm like, I'm like 50% like sure of this. <laughs> and Drew's oh. overcommitted now. Big overcommit. The supernova down, and they're dead. And mill three heroes, and From wow, Doom is just running in. Oh, wait, Armel wants to turn it around. The Nightmare is gonna come out from Pile I Die. Mischief, not enough. Oh, he's got destroyed. KP with the Bracers. He had two Devour stacks, which is 48 region. Very, very hard to kill that hero, despite having only three plus five armor. And that's Face the type of only armor item thing where in the previous patch it would have been a kill on a KP, but oh, absolutely. the yeah, changes definitely. in anticipating your amount of damage. Mm -hmm. Radiant structures are They're thinking this guy just has bracers. Like he's killable for sure. But is under this is it. where it's a huge fight because it's like the two carries are just matching each other's farm and to win that 4v4 fight with a complete wipe is huge. I think if, I think if you're the team that has the Zeus 2 against the illusion heroes, you're perfectly fine going Going and late. Yep. You see, like, th the impact that the Naga Siren has over the Terra Blade in that fight, too. Comes in with the song, makes sure that they don't have that extra damage to yeah. throw into the Doom. Like, yeah, I would I would like to see TB, like, consider joining a fight like that. Like, they, they immediately ran in once Doom was used, and I think you almost want to call your TB over. Like, push out lanes with your illusions and join us with your hero. Yeah, you'd think with the hood that he, he would fight. Like, yeah. That's kind of the purpose of that item, in a way. Yeah, almost. so he can fight into the Zeus. He was low on mana. Like he had like 150, 200 mana. I think when they were, he, when he was just hitting those ancients and his team were going to the enemy jungle, so maybe that was part of it. Like he could meta but not sunder. Yeah. Well, also yeah. where they took the fight too. Yeah. It's, it's pretty rough for him to get Probably there. If he's on the Zeus other side is of the actually map. kind of far up here. Monkey is not sure who's behind him though. Oh well. Now he knows a bit better now. Can they kill off this brew in time? Yes, indeed. And now he sees where the monkey king is, and monkey king forced to run away. Well, and this is what gets so scary if you're TNC. You just lost a game against this team. You're one game away from getting eliminated from the major qualifiers, and you lost a huge fight now getting people picked off in your own jungle. Pressure starts to mount. Yeah, this is this is not an easy draft, either to win with just a Terra Blade farming. Zeus, uh, the, the uh, what's his face? Grim boy, that boy. Grimstroke. He's very, very good also against all the illusions. Naga Siren, excellent in the late game. I would imagine Terrorblade probably beats her. Uh, I'm not sure how that matchup actually works, but I, I don't know. It's They have lots of Cuckoo. Could maybe go for Roche here. So 18-minute Roche. Not quite as early as the morph, but could be a big moment for them. And Dyer actually scanned, hitting on a Ninja Boogie as he walks forward. They might think that that's a smoke play and going to just try and retreat. Or... Yeah, that almost makes this rush initially safer in some ways. You see that scan, you're like, oh, they're running up our ramp or something, but they... Whoops. <laughs> they're all the way back in the pit. I like that Zeus is not just building ether lens into eggs just because of the uh, of the nerfs and the fact that I think he wants to contribute to these fights more so than just using the you know the ulti. He wants to stay in the fights a lot and the uh, the four staff is going to let him get in and then get out. You have to position and play so far back if you don't have an item like a four staff. Yeah. Like the the TP build often involves event, like get eventually getting like a BKB blink so you can just blink on the Zeus.
Mm -hmm. um, Monkey King's a hero that can just jump on you, so you need that maybe four stuff mobility as well. Great against Lion too, just for saving your team. Oh, get hexed and just force somebody away. You can't get the impale. Radiant starting to take a little bit better advantage of this game as the Sentry Ward is going to scout out KP moving yep. over this way. He's good about getting these Devour stacks before he goes for these aggressive moves. Yep. Having double Devour makes a big difference if you're trying to run in and get that Doom off. You can see that also Ninja Boogie is not going to be an initiator in this game, going for the Bracer build. Yeah, last time I think I saw him do this line, he went like four or five Bracers. He's happy to tank up as much as possible. Playing against Zeus makes sense a bit. Well, the magic resist really helps this game. We'll lose Phoenix. They do have the grip if they want to use it. I think we maybe right, hoping somebody's going to come and try and contest here. Yeah, let's say he's well positioned in these trees. Needs to stay near his tower. The doom on Phoenix is absolutely worth it. Phoenix or Brew, if you can get either of those heroes, you're you're set. Secure the team fight. Yeah, yeah the so ultimate's so Radiant's important for the team fights. Yeah. Uh, they're going to bring Radiant's in the Monkey King here, and actually on the other side they find him, and this is what the Bane was looking for, that Lion. And Radiant's Sleep just to TP out to play it safe, although potentially, I mean, there were only three Radiant heroes, but I guess most of Maneski had already left. Grimstroke was top, yeah. and they did not want to take their chances. Maneski, 6,000 gold lead Radiant's right now after those couple of attack. bad fights, and you can see it's just basically been all them. Still pretty even as far as Dota yep. buff probability. I like TP still, maybe. Good old, good old Dota buff. Dota plus. Whoops, wrong one. <laughs> Sorry, Val. <laughs> I didn't mean it to promote your competitor. Dota, Dota buff <laughs> is so lucky that they called it their site Dota Buff and Valve called it Dota Plus. Because there is a site called Dota Plus. They, they Dota sponsor buff. Bulldog. The, there's like a Dota Plus. Is there? Yeah, Dota it's a Plus website. It's Dota Buff. Dota Buff Plus. Yeah, Dota Buff Plus. No, there's, uh, there's a there's totally a separate site, website. Right? Oh, is there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's like DotaPL.us. But <laughs> so sure. many people... I, I think I've seen on Bulldog too. So many people sure. mispronounced Dota Plus and they say Dota Buff Plus because it came first. Yeah, yeah. It's like that is just free advertising. That's true. For Dota buff, it's like the the promo code BSJ meme. It's just free advertising for he who shall not be named on this stream. Mm. For BSJ? No, Dyer's for Game Leap, dog. <laughs> <laughs> it is free advertising yeah, for BSJ too, true. actually. Dyer's top tower oh. has fallen. Well, at the same time, Valve, you know, they probably gained some good ideas from Dota buff plus. Uh, that's true. So like a lot of the stuff on Dota Buff uh, has been implemented in various forums, Dyer's which is great. Top. Put it in the game. People are in game. They're not all on the the World Wide Web. This is actually just going to be. Uh, Zeus needed to be in well position for that. This is uh, this is a problem. Now Monkey Ult, so you can't even get close as well. And they've lifted up the Zeus. They they don't have the damage. Oh. They don't have the answer. That's so smart from the Brew, although he did kill oh, the Wind Panda now. This. KP doesn't have Doom. Eight more seconds. Needs to get into position, but the Double Doom could come out. They need four more seconds to wait before they can get it, and it doesn't look like it's going to matter. They still find the kill. The Silence is there. Now the Supernova able to dodge away from the stun. He has a Doom up for the Terrorblade. Looking for round two. Ding, ding, ding. Got him caught, possibly. The good stun coming through, and Silence is there. They're still hanging on to it for the moment. Did they just Ooh. kill him off? He was turning for his Sunder there, it looked like. They tried. But they lost the lane of Rax. Yeah, it's pro it's worth it for TNC. That 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 is one of the the core reasons that Terrorblade was so strong in the previous patch is that no matter what, you can always take a fight and then just Rax your opponents. I mean, you don't even need to take a fight. You can just just <laughs> drop just all your ultimates your right <laughs> right right on the Rax and Rax them. Before the fight even starts, the hero just shreds towers so quickly. The combo with the brew too, because you can't just like outspam with Zeus. You, you just run the wind panda up there, and then yeah, Monkey King ult as well. Like these are just the two best rack zoning ultimates with the best raxing hero, one of the best raxing heroes in the game. Boogie, they're moving in. They get the Doom onto the Monkey. Got him caught. The hoof stomp onto three KP. Are you kidding me? Monkey King, gonna get caught there as well. They bring in this Terra Blade, but what is he really gonna do? They now have the song, and he's gonna be able to walk away from this. Very nice from Maneski. So even though they've lost Rax, they're just putting on some great team fights, knowing that Metamorph is down. And round these ultis two. being down is just such a big deal. A, a 
Oh my god, he has the hoof stomp yeah. afterwards. He actually ended up messing up that sleep though, and now they find the kill. Three dead for TNC, and Tim's in trouble, almost dies to that Nimbus. These, these Grimstrike silences out of Febby have been very timely. And well Don't even played. need the Doom, man. He's got yeah. a Doom right there. His name's Grimstro. <laughs> so Permanent oh. silence. <laughs> that was a buyback a from the slightly Phoenix. Slightly shorter cooldown. Yeah. Although, hey, can you steal Hoof Stomp on Grimstroke? I think not. Oh, that's, that's a good point. Okay, well, Shiva's Guard's coming out for Doom. Um, despite the fact that they just lost the lane of Rax, they're up 6,000 gold. Yeah. Get a lot of gold from getting the Rax, too, so that, that says a lot. It's not just like about the lane pressure. You, you do very literally get like well, uh, 3,000 gold. After something. the Rex, it was like a 2k gold lead, and then they went and win that fight, yeah, I yeah. think. It was like, we went from 6k to 2k, and now back to 6k. Yep. As Mineski just seemed BKB so on, on point with these team fights. TB. Now, I, now I think you need to doom the, the TB in these next couple of fights until the... Uh, oh, they the want this doom. They know there's no ult. Uh, this is uh, it's kind of a lot, though, for him. Yeah, they want to I mean, chase. They, 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 they get more with the Panda. Yeah, but they... I think he smoked. Grimstroke can't be caught by the Cyclone. I think he was afraid that he was about to be Cycloned by an Invis group. Well, that was, like you said, a lot expended, but now the Metamorphosis and onto the Glyph. They do have the Zeus in position now, though. So. I think they're okay to just slow this game down, TNC. Taking out a tower, full back, and keep farming. Because your meta, by the time you get to high ground, the meta's not going to have too much duration left, but they may want to just fight this one. All right, I don't think this is a great fight he can well. force out. Still fine for the moment. Now they have the Ink Swole on top of them as well. Have they gone a bit too far? There's going to be a Fiend Scrap immediately broken, but still in some trouble is Gabby. They need to make their way out of here. All of the illusions hitting illusions, but... New TBPL. Well, looks like Gabby is going to be able to escape for now. They're still chasing Song of the Siren as well, but... Where is that at? God's name? For Just looking. Fishing for something, or yeah. thought there was a TB there, maybe? Yep. Okay. Almost got his heart on Naga. He can run into these fights and actually do some damage without worrying about just getting annihilated instantly. Now I know that it's like the old way to do it, but is there any value for like a super late game radiance on Naga still? Like against the TB? Uh, I feel like you probably go for that on, on Doom. And they have they have answers to the to the T B already in the in the Zeus, you'd almost want to build more like sieging items. They're probably typical carry items, like a butterfly would work, just yeah. just to uh, do more damage to towers. Butterfly, Scotties. If you're against Monkey King, TP, right clickers, like those tanky items, yeah, go a long way. Dyer's top shrine is under attack. Ooh, the Ring of Tarask. And Gabby moving forward towards the shrine. Needs to be careful about not getting doomed or something here. They have song in 15 seconds. Hex there onto Bane. And it looks like they're going to start rotating in. Radiant's Cuckoo, the one out front. KP has Doom available. He's they a good Doom target, well. man. Oh, I thought about it. Just not sure. The mana drain every time. It's scary when you know like, they're pinging the ward. They have total vision that they can fight around. I think KP TNC. needs to be careful about not running into these sentries still. Yeah. Even now with the Devour stacks, there's just more fire and more damage. If they blow up this Doom, uh, the fight does not go well for Maneski. And he's done a really good job of not just running it and dying. The later and later this game goes, the less and less tanky Doom is going to get with yeah. respect to the Devour because the region doesn't scale like it did before. Yeah. He's going to get additional strength, but that base region coming from Devour is not going to give him that much. Especially against the Terra Blade. Yeah, that's the thing on the Radiant side, TB is just getting item after item and is, is gonna his damage is scaling into the late game. Yep. Well, Doom's survivability. And with a BKB it adds up, but you're not getting that off if you walk into a Hex. I think this is the best that we've seen a Grimstroke play so far, I would say. Um, yeah, Febby's I think so. Feb very impressive. Febby's a really good Grimstroke. Part of that's, I think, too, because they've been able to get, like, a couple either Fiend's Grip with it or Doom with it. Yeah, they play as a team around it really well. The e even, the, even the Zeus using his, like, double Arc Lightning, clearing the Illusions and double Thunderbolt, uh, Thunderbolt like, this guy's doing so much damage. I wonder if it works with the Nimbus. Probably not. That'd be pretty cool if it did. That'd be nuts. Like quadruple thunderbolt. Lion is also getting a lot of golden experience just killing off these illusions with the mana drain. Yeah, that's that's a nice little buff to him.
hurts the Naga a lot too to kill those because the yeah. cooldown on it's actually relatively long. On the mana drain, multi shot comes out too. It's gonna be pretty nuts. Four seconds for three. They walk in, they find themselves one. It's on to Cuckoo. He gets the split off though. Still caught for the moment. They throw out the fan on the embrace. Lift up immediately. Hacks out as well on a KP. Not a good He's play. caught oh. up on the high ground. He couldn't force Staff away. He thinks about dropping the Doom and he does hit it onto the Terra Blade with that supernova hitting as well. JT walking away. Song of Siren out, but the Finger of Death comes out as well, and now they need to run away again. JT in trouble as they're chasing. The stun still hits on the That was the a Roche Bash, I think. And he's going to walk away from there. Feet script from the high ground. Pilot Dai trying to save his carry. It's looking like it might all be for naught, although it was a buyback from KP, who's going in with the they're Shiva's guard, the slowing Naga. down. They don't have a Doom available, and Gabby still has Sunder, but it looks like they are going to be able to find that kill on a Cuckoo. That Naga was so tanky there. TP meta was just right clicking Naga and doing almost no damage. Yeah. He was four armor. He was song too, so it was it was really just the TP hitting with the yeah. with the Brew uh, green panda. Lots of lots of armor on the Naga. It's not quite the damage to chase him down. <laughs> Can't believe Roche bashed him <laughs> mid jump. <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> Very unfortunate. Uh, okay. Oh my God. Gonna, gonna, yeah, I think stop him from doing Bounty. anything with Roche right now. Do they have Song again? <sighs> they have it in 10 seconds? Yeah, meanwhile, Meta's down for like another 70-ish, probably 60 maybe. I think they can do this. It's just you're being delayed, and the more you delay, the more you buy time with your TNC to get Metamorph going. Yeah. Naga Illusion's in the pit, so if the Radiant scan the pit, they're gonna it's going to proc the scan, so they could potentially do some baits with this. They see enough heroes right now. Yeah. Like they saw them leave the pit. They've got a ward right in the area. And yeah, they see everyone mid now. TB's just going to get back to farming. He knows that this isn't going to be a fight. And likewise, Loon heads up towards the north side of the map. It feels like they need more bursts. Like, I'm thinking E Blades, Dagons maybe at some point, because TB is just not dying. I think they're fine. I think they're. Like, if the Zeus can get to the level 25, the. TB is a, a non a not a non issue like especially okay. with the BKB running off. Okay, he's gonna have a five second BKB pretty soon. What's the Monkey King guy? He just bought BKB, I believe. And yeah, you had the mouse really. Okay. I like the Maelstrom just because they need more magic damage against this super high Amon Naga Siren. Yeah, for sure. There's like almost nothing to kill those illusions right now, other than the lion. Phoenix is going to be using the uh, the egg, not really the sun ray in these fights, so can't take out those illusions super easily. Smoke out. I have used Nimbus. You know Nimbus can very slowly solo Roche. You can you, you can actually kill Roche with it takes like seven Nimbuses, but Highlight die dead, but immediately going to get out that Doom. The Soulbind onto two, but do they have enough damage? There's going to be the egg on top of all of them, and they were able to get the spirits as well. So TNC looking good. KP like he's going to die. They did lose the Monkey King. Yeah. Trades his life and his Doom for the... Oh, Highlight die. It's a dieback, maybe. Uh, it's a dieback on KP. Oh, one last hit comes Not in. Enough. They had Fiend's Grip available, too, and now I don't know if they can do this anymore. JT needs to run. Brew, he dodges the, the boulder from the Brewmaster. Down bottom, they're pushing this lane, and Ninja Boogie's not there anymore. He pulled back for potential fight, and then ends up just doing some wave pushing. Yeah, I'll get a shrine here. It's a pretty even fight in the end. Doom Bane for Monkey King. Bane dying twice, so slightly better for TNC. Yeah, we're going to be able to get Roche but this, off this. This BKB duration is a very big thing as you go into late game. Yeah. This matters... We kind of we kind of find ourselves in a situation where, like, the fights are really depending on how Doom, like, who Doom gets Doom off on. Right. And once again, like, every one of these fights, it just kind of feels like some uh, Three Stooges shit, where he runs in and like just running away and like all this awkward stuff going on. Silence onto two of them here. They're catching him out. Thunder God's Wrath out as well. Ninja Boogie, he's dead. Oh. Die back on the line. Can they get into position close enough? Armel, they jump in. They're able to get the Aegis onto Gabby and Moon going to go down as well. Did GT. Moon force himself in? Cheese? Oh, he sold the cheese. Nice. It's a decent way to make it work. Does have Song in three seconds trying to live. Inkswell ends up getting dodging of the stun. 
And with the song, the walk away. Looks like they should be able to get out of there. No, wait, oh, what, what's the song? Oh, oh they media tip. <laughs> oh. <laughs> New kid on the block. He's going to get his oh, lunch man. money stolen. Oh, Quick man. fingers by Gabby. He was the first tipper. <laughs> Instantly, before he even got the kill, was, was there. <laughs> oh, you want to get in the head of the young Maneski carry player. He's the new guy on the team. I swear to God, it looked like he canceled the song while he was TPing. Yeah. Just I, think it, I, I think he may have canceled his TP and with while, while canceling the song. And again, it, you, I don't know. you can see, it's like a good idea. You go in, you steal the cheese. Like interrupted the TP by canceling the song, <laughs> you mean. Uh, oh my maybe. God. Because he started his TP. He, it, looked yeah. like, it looked like he canceled... Oh. The song after he was already TPing. Well, and the uh, the Zeus, I looked like he forced stopped into the Roche pit. Yeah, that I don't think you can make that play as the Zeus. Even <laughs> no, uh, that is so yeah. It's such a low percentage play. You know, you got to play the percentages in a game like this, and it's like I'm coming. <laughs> it's not even like a, if you had a blink, it's maybe a different story. That I, I don't just, think that's good. It's but. just the job of somebody else to go for that crazy stuff. Yes, it's. It's it, a support job or like an offlaner type job, like a Doom or somebody. If the Zeus is alive, there's no high grounding that can happen. He is he is the insurance policy. Well, I mean, lesson learned though. I'm I'm sure he'll. That was like a high pressure situation. He's thinking, oh god, what did I just? None do? of Radiant have a four stuff, right? It was definitely Zeus. Oh, I'm 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 sh I I'm pretty sure he, yeah, he was I trying to. Phoenix do doesn't. Because that was Lions doing the only might. Yeah, he's he's got a blink. Now. We saw the Roche anxiety in the last game too. It's just the same thing. Oh, TB has a hurt. No, it wouldn't work with that Hurricane Pike. No, okay, you're right. So TB has mm. Daedalus queued up. Once, just needs more damage against this Naga. Don't. This is still don't what's weird him. about this game, though. Is it's like a three thousand gold lead for TNC. They're behind in kills. Like they got that Rax and Mineski was up when they had it. And now it's going back the other way. It's like so many strange things in this game. Yeah, we, we find ourselves moving into the late game where... I, I like this right here, by the way. It seems like a small thing, but the fact that he's going, ha, 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 you know, like, that was a moment where you could sort of have some tension in the team. You see you're not going to make a big mistake like that, you laugh it off. You know, try and get the veteran leadership. Everyone's pretty stressed out right now, I imagine. Last exactly. year three of the SEA qualifiers. Oh, Winner of this goes it again. to the Chongqing Major. And they're just going to send in this. They're going to try cycling the Zeus while they siege the tower. All right. Double Doom is the play if they can get it going. And they already have the song. Okay. A nice way to find the back lines. And oh, up on wow. the high ground. If they can get both of them here, this would be absolutely huge. Trying to find it. But immediately the supernova oh, comes out. And he's hexed as well. Oh, it goes from good to tragedy in just finger. a second. Oh, my God. They're all going to fall. Finger of death out. It looked good. But oh, no, 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 no. Oh, they're tipping him again. They know they're in his head. Oh, They want to tilt him all the way into game three. That was destruction of the highest order, oh. and Gabby still standing tall here. Oh, they just have nothing to follow up with the Naga song. Yeah, they, that's, there's, there's actually they nothing no, at all. That's from the start. It's like they can't stun. We saw when Doom like Shadowblade in for a Doom early in the game, and they just walk away. They are just so bad at forcing fights, which is why I don't like that play because they defend high ground wall. They have Zeus. They can just delay. They have Naga. Just <laughs> delay. <laughs> He's just punching him. And JT, all he wants to do is kill the support. JT he will get, get it. Low. But oh, that dive. He's <laughs> just going in. They all don't care. All the way across the screen. They, they do are. Lose. They may lose some more. Cuckoo's very dead, it looks like. <laughs> it's like, please don't see me. <laughs> oh, they're taunting him. There we go. They're like making it seem like he might live. Oh, my goodness. So two lanes of Rex. Gives TNC a pretty strong advantage wow. here. Late game, uh, Veil of Discord pick up on the on the uh, Zeus. Hmm. He's uh, really that? looking to to kill these illusions. Think the thing is, like in the late game, it's it is a good item for for damage. Yeah, I mean the BKBs get shorter. The hood now no longer there as well. Yeah. When he gets level 25, this whole game looks different. Although with a 12k gold lead. Pretty, that's pretty rough. It's, it's a, it's a Ooh. hard mountain to climb. Oh, and yeah. What do you think is a, is a bigger mountain, the the gold mountain or the tilt mountain? 
I don't know. I mean, it depends on JT's mental state. Like, he, he's had a couple <laughs> of rough ones right there. We haven't there. seen any of the emotes come from him. No, that's Radiant true. Are it's tough. This, yeah. Well, <laughs> picks up the regen. He didn't cancel. Illusion rune. Yeah, he's fine running all over here. Daedalus is going to be the pickup for the Terra Blade. And well, you look at this, there's a couple heroes without buyback uh, on the Dire team. But they're still going to keep the waves pushed out. And they'll have it pretty well for a while. Uh, Grimstroke picks up the Hex, so he can kind of set up his own fight now. As Grim is perhaps the late game hope for Mineski, hitting double dooms or double hexes, all that good jazz. It needs it's kind of crazy how farmed Febby is. Almost as farmed as the Doom. Doom is literally he has a GPM talent, yeah. but, yeah, but Doom is you know, only. Doom is devouring creeps and getting yeah, yeah. hundreds of gold. So he went the devour bonus gold too. He is also there, like alongside Zeus. He's there, wave clear, and all the, yeah. all of the time. Uh, Ooh, that is an important hero. And are they going to be able to find him? Yes, they will indeed. KP right. wants to make this happen, but the song, okay, saving Moon. Four staff away, trying to live. He's having no stuns here again. He's going to TP out, and it looks like JT is going to be able to walk home also. They go in. This is really hard to find this kill here, and KP's moving into position too. JT they living. They've soon. got the Glimmer. Force, is it they there in him, time? Earth Spike and no. He does not have a buyback, and the Soulbind comes too God, late. KP it's on to a couple of Brulings. TP can't Sunder, so he's just going to disengage, but he's got plenty of health to survive the Doom. And just like that, they're this going to be able to walk away. They've got creeps. This is probably going to be the Megas. Doom buyback without ultimate is not going to cut it. I like that they didn't turn and try to fight at least, so now the, Zeus, the Zeus is still alive, and they can... I don't They can watch their racks go down. Ah, I mean, if he gets... If he There's an egg and everything. So. Yeah, they have ways to, to get on top of Oh, that. they got the Hex hook. That's okay. how you defend, maybe? Nah. JG, <laughs> <laughs> <Gee, gee. laughs> we got a game three. TV still garbage, guys. Oh, wait, sorry. See, TV won. <laughs> Doom's Doom still garbage. garbage. We, yeah, knew one, we knew one of the garbage right, heroes was right. going to lose. <laughs> we flame TV. We flame Doom. That's that's why you have to flame a hero on both teams. <laughs> maybe you they're You're never terrible. wrong. <laughs> Somebody has to win. Maybe they're both bad. Yeah, yeah. When you pick one terrible hero against another <laughs> terrible hero, it's just 50-50 <laughs> again. The Doom actually looked all right. I, I mean, the huge problem was just the lack of stuns. Like, no right. fall for sleep, no real good way to engage. And that, I mean, that's often the offlaner's role, which is what Doom Although doesn't bring. We did still see Doom have the same issue of, like, having to Doom a target <laughs> for the fight to go exactly. well, but he just can't get it off because the Doom cast time is just so, so long. Yeah, Mineski's now lost three games in a row with Doom. They lost two games in a row with TB and stopped picking him. So I think these, you know, three games, maybe stop picking the Doom. Yeah. If Naga's coming back, maybe Disruptor thrown in there. I don't know. Some it's some sort of like follow up. It, you need something, um, but you may as well. You know. Well, and to me, it's like part of it is follow up for Naga, and I think it's just having a stun in general. Like who's who's your your initiation was kind of like a Grimstroke ultimate or something. Like yeah. Yeah. it's at least I mean the slow is great, but it's not gonna really start a fight off for you well. Yeah. But Maybe, maybe it was, a, it was still a close game. Mineski were ahead for a lot of it. Yeah. Maybe with some other heroes to like start the fight, Doom Doom yeah. might look a little better. Yeah, like the the four position stunners. But that's like I don't know. When you pick that Grimstroke first, and Febby's the only one who plays it, where you you can't really get that like. Yeah, I mean, so maybe Pilot I needs to play like Disruptor. the Axe type heroes. Disruptor, yeah, that's kind. It of is a little weird to to pick Naga with Grimstroke because Grimstroke wants these like single target spells and the Naga wants the AoE ground target yeah, and stuff true. so it's just like yeah, two totally yeah. two totally different styles of hero mm -hmm. yeah. yeah that's definitely an issue well ladies and gentlemen uh, we are going the distance and that's good because these games have been freaking amazing we've seen so far I think eight games or seven games today and we're going to go up to eight uh, we have, uh, yeah first series was a two I stomp mm -hmm. yeah uh, so stay tuned, everybody. TNC Predator facing off against Mineski. Winner is going to the major. Let's find out who it is right after this.